in the normal world, our world, not the future anymore. So, how are you doing guys, Dragon Blaze here, and today we're going back to our world. Yes, finally. Chapter 17, the God Screw. And of course our world is the God, because the God is fucking amazing. Look at that Wigglytuff, look at it being amazing. Ah, nice Wigglytuff. Here we are, Andrew, Wigglytuff's God. It feels as if we were gone a long time, but... Now that we're here, it's kind of awkward to go in. After all, we were suddenly taken away in front of everyone. That would be sort of strange. It would be sort of strange to suddenly show up. No, we can't be acting all bashful. We have to see everyone and tell them the truth. Okay, I'll send above the sentry post. Oh my god, this is going to be so good. Diglett is going to detect his footprint and then he's going to remember him. Her footprint, his footprint. The footprint belongs to... <gasps> What's wrong, Daglad? Respond, respond! What? Hey, Daglad! Where do you think you're burrowing off to? The, the, the footprint! It's Grelix! What? Oh, uh, ah? What? It's Grelix and Andrew, too! Daglad! Long time no see! Oh my lord, wow, what's that? Oh god, just the gates is going to open. Oh, look, look at Loudred, look at Peter, look at Chermaker, look at uh, Corfitch, look at Girl, um, not Grova, look at uh, Girl Gunk, look at Duck Trio, look at some Flora, ah, uh, some Flora, nice to see you back again. Hey, hey, it's true. Oh my gosh, it really is Andrew's critic. Oh my god, I have to put it on my Twitter and on my Facebook and on my MySpace. You're both alive! We, we, we were so much about you. I, I, I was my role. Uh, everyone, we're home. Oh my lord, everyone is so happy that we're back. Nice and back. Ah, uh, look at Wigglytuff. Welcome home, bro, Skrillex and Andrew, yes. Ah, uh, yes, bitch, we're back. We're back. What? What was that again? Just, just hold for a moment, just hold for a moment. Hold up, hold up. Let me get this story straight. Okay. Ahem, let me summarize your story so far. First, Grove was actually a good Pokemon, and he was collecting the time girls to save the world and not really stealing them? Yes. And the Great Dawson only pretended to be kind and helpful, but he was actually a heinous and wicked villain that wanted to destroy you from history? Yes, though I didn't really phrase it as heinous and wicked, but whatever. Also, Andrew was really Grove's partner? Yes. So doesn't want to get rid of both Andrew and Groval, so he took them to the future to destroy them and wreck their lives? Yes, and me too, don't worry, me. don't forget about me. Then you managed to escape from Dustmar by the skin of your teeth while he actually was following you together with his Sableye that he might have gotten from Belgian Extra Large but nobody actually knows, and you barely made it back home from the future? Yes! And finally, this plan will soon become paralyzed, and to prevent that, Grovo has started gathering time gears again to stop the plan's paralysis. Meanwhile, you two are looking for a place called the Hidden Land, and then trying to get there. Is that your story in its full entirety? Yes, that's all of it. Wow. <laughs> oh, Skrillex and Andrew, you must have had a bad dream or something. What? Why don't you two just go to your room and get some rest? It's all fine. What? Wait a second, you think we're lying? What we just told you is all the truth. I'm sure, I'm sure, it's really whatever. Just go to your room, seriously. I'm sure you two are suffering from exhaustion. And good now, we'll fix that, and then you guys can go back to work. That's not it, Chadot! Seriously, we're telling you the truth! That's quite enough! So shut your mouth! So tell me, is there any part of your story that's even remotely plausible? A place called the Hidden Land? Get the fuck out of here with the bullshit! I'm the head of intelligence here, and I've heard of no such place! Really, besides the Great Dustnor, it's far too kind to do anything like you've alleged. I mean, he's awesome! Get the fuck out of here! Well, yes, I couldn't believe the truth about Dustnor either. It came as a huge shock, and it was really hard to accept, but... 
I will hear no more of this. Shut your mouth. Go to your room. Seriously, I don't care what you say. The great dust noir, the villain, get the fuck out of here with that bullshit lie I already said. That's simply unbelievable. Seriously, do you two feel the same way? How can anybody seriously think of the great dust noir as a villain? We all dust noir in high esteem. We cannot believe it. You, shut your mouth. See? 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 Everyone shares the same opinion. No one believes you. But, um... Huh? What is it, Sunflora? Tell us, baby. There is something that I just don't understand. Like, that one time when the great Dust Noir... Like, I still know... I still think that he's, like, amazing, but... What's about to return to the future and stuff? Like... It's too soon for four hells! Wah! You two are going with me! Wah! My gosh! Skrillex, Andrew! Hmm. What was that? What the fuck just happened? What the great and awesome does know where they then? Um, it was strange. Anyway, you look at it. I, I'm really still questioning that. Like, really. I've even asked my Twitter followers and my Instagram followers and all, and they didn't know either. Really? Do you think so? Don't you think that Skritix and Andrew fell into the dimensional hole by accident? I mean, it can happen, of course. No way! Doesn't work grabbed Skrillex and Andrew and yanked them in! Hey, hey, that's right. It looked that way to me, too. Hey, what happened was really weird, though. Gosh, I really had to wonder why Dustin Moore did something like that. I mean, I was even just trying to go on my Twitter, Facebook, and my Instagram, but no one follows me, so... If... if what Skrillex said is true, then what Dustin Moore did suddenly makes perfect sense. What? Wait a minute! Seriously, stop! So this is what you think now? Are you actually saying that you now believe what Squidus and Andrew are claiming is true? Uh, maybe? Well, what's your answer? Give me some answers! Uh, I, uh, I, I believe them, I guess. What? What did you just say? It's so do you're not claiming that the Great Doctor is a villain? Are you cray cray? Uh, but, but the Golly, I sincerely did think I am the Great Dust Noir. The whole idea is so troubling when you put it that way, but there is something more important there. Yup, yup, Andrew and Skrillex are more important, that's why I believe that Andrew and Skrillex have to say. Well, what? Me too. Hey, I believe you too. Me too, oh my god. And I just asked all my Twitter followers and shit, and they are believing you guys too. I mean, there's no problem. There are golf colleagues out there. Oh, what the hell, man? Oh, Grova and Sephora. I believe them. Me too. So do I. Casting doubts on our colleagues is wrong. Trust is a must. Wow, that th is what you say after you just go and complain about all our shenanigans. Really. Squawk! <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Thank you for believing us. Well, hiya! Sounds like we all agree. Huh? We all believe our friends. That's great. Then let's begin searching for the hidden land, bros. Whoa, just hold on there, Goldmaster. Uh, what's wrong, bro? We're not all in agreement, are we yet? Everyone looks at Jato. Huh? We're all good with the story. But I suspect that Chattel is a convinced. Oh, is that all? <laughs> you don't need to worry about Chattel. Huh? Chattel is convinced, right? What? Huh? Uh, because Chattel believed Skrillex's story all along, right, Chattel? <laughs> what? How peculiar, oh my god. Well, Goldmaster, uh, there's no fooling you, I admit it. Uh, yes, I believed Andrew and Skrillex right from the start. Huh? Really? But if I would have said that, I believed them right away, everyone would have just gone along with what I said. What's all this? That's why I was so contrary. I wanted to put your friendship to the test. Gosh, lively story. But without a doubt, I was convinced from the get-go. 
I knew everyone would surely believe their colleagues. Says you. <laughs> um, well, at least that explains why he said that we accidentally fell into the portal. Like, he grabbed us, literally. There was no falling. There was no tripping. He just grabbed us straight up. Andrew, Skrillex, I believe you. You're my good friends in the gold uh, membership. Now listen, everyone. Thanks to st damn is stopping in more and more places. From Skrillex's story, we know our world is in danger. That means we have to do something, right? This is our time. In the name of Wilitos God, we'll combine all our efforts. We'll discover the hidden land. Let's do this, everyone. Wait, if we discover the hidden land, uh. Does it mean that it has to be called the Discovered Land? I mean, the ju just saying. Um, Alright. Chill out. Hey, yeah, yeah, sir. Um, okay, everyone. From now on, we're shifting all our efforts to locating the hidden land. I don't care about putting in all the work and just getting all the money from all the jobs. Just try and find the hidden land. We also have to let everyone know what is happening in our world. It's going to get busy. We all have to work hard. I sure will. But don't do treasure time. I'll get the word out by golly. I'll go too. We have to let Azel and his friends know as well. I mean, they cannot just be like, be there out there and just don't know. I mean, just don't know. I mean, what the hell they have to know? If they're back on their legs, they might try to stop Brova. I mean, seriously, that, that wouldn't be that nice of a thing. Hey, then I'll go tell them. Okay, everyone else, search for the hidden land, please. Yeah. You do, so far, uh, others are. Uh, Others, um, once your errands are done, get information on the inner land. Yes, sir. Well, Harry, don't worry about it. We'll find hidden land together. Yum time. All right. All right. Let's show some guts. Hey, hey, hey. Wow, everyone is not talking. Seriously, everyone is believing us. I'm sorry that I don't have any information on the inner land, but maybe the white historical the town elder may know something. Historical, the town elder. That won't be the wisest and oldest but one of Treasure Town. He loves the hot spring, so he's always there. In fact, I'm positive that you'll find him at the hot spring, lol. Oh, I remember. My goodness, it was the water that carried you all this way. What a long journey that must have been. Let the hot spring wash away your fatigue before you make your way home. Taka! Good idea, we'll do that. Thanks, everyone. It's him! It's that nice old Pokemon we met. You should be you should put his years of wisdom to use. Go ask Dorka for advice. The first time we went to the hot spring, we had to get there through Waterfall Cave Andrew. Let's go onward to Hot Spring. But first, if it's getting late and besides. You must be hungry. Huh? Oh, wow. My stomach growled. Haha, <laughs> yours did too. You should have dinner, then get a good night's sleep. We can all get to work tomorrow. Oh my god, I really have to eat, I'm fast. Hey, Andrew's belly's growled again. Oh, <laughs> did everyone hear that? What a laugh, Andrew. Letting your belly bark at your mecca, eh? Oh my god, they're not just laughing at me like that. Seriously, I'm getting bullied here. Damn. Okay, and now we're just going to eat. Seriously, I need some gummies, to be honest. Because I did not... I mean, I cannot just live without any of Spinda's fucking gummy frappuccinos. I mean, what the hell? I mean, otherwise I will just get fucking hungry and thirsty and... I don't know. It's been so long since we've been in this room. It feels as if though I'm finally home. You know... I'm glad everyone came to deliver our story uh, to deliver believe our story. Okay, I cannot read. I made me it made me a little choked up. Let's go meet Torkel tomorrow and talk with him. Let's get back at it tomorrow, Andrew. I was thinking about Chatot and then like how competitive Chatot works. Like boom burst through a sub, that shit is just amazing. Like that a attack if it is sound based goes through subs like you get fucking wrecked by that shit like oh you get wrecked mate catch it boom boom like because like most of the boomers actually to be honest if a Pokemon uses boomers most of the time it does like more than fifty percent so yeah Ahem. so wrapping up everyone's aware of their duties today 
my god, yes, I'm all ready to go, yes, bitch, yes. Good. Those of you investigating the land, those of you spreading the word about the true state of affairs, I expect you to organize your teams accordingly and get going. Let's get right to it, everyone. Hooray! Okay, just let us now go. Don't talk to us anymore, Chad. We must go to the hot spring and get information from the wise old Torko. I think we had to go through a wonderful cave to get to the hot spring. So let's make our way to the hot spring, Andrew. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so what we have to do is, I don't really think that we actually need a team member right now, so what we can do is we can just go outside, wait a minute, it's a, oh yeah, okay, we were at the go, so I was already thinking like, is the music supposed to still go on for that long? Um, okay, I think we can talk to you actually, oh, okay, so there wasn't anything uh, locked, um, unlocked any anymore. I haven't seen you anymore, where have you been? Um, yeah, I, I don't think that he was there while it happens. Oh, our egg! Our egg, I forgot our, about our egg, we got an egg. I'm glad to see you're safe. Oh yeah, okay, I'm also glad to see you're safe, Chansey. How are you, girl? I mean, I just want to actually check on my egg. The egg, is it? Could it be? Come on, could it be? Will it? Oh, what? The egg hatched and, and it is a, I'm closing my eyes right now, it's a Wingo! Oh my god! Oh my god, no! I get a wingle. <laughs> oh, the wingle wants to join your team. Oh my god. No, I'm going to refuse. No, just kidding. Oh my god. Oh no. No, I am so torn between nicknames because, because I can call it Wongle Manadi. Can I call it Wongle Manadi? Or no, Wongle it is. Oh no. Or what should I call it? Should I call it Wongle? Or should I call it. Um, Pico or Scarfed God. I don't even think that I can call it Scarfed God. If I can call it Scarfed God, I will, I will take Scarfed God. Scarfed. No, 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 no. You're not going to tell me that I can do this. No, you're not. Scarfed God. I'm so sorry, Wong Gollum. I'm so sorry. Scarfed God. Oh my God, we have Scarfed God. Oh my God. Oh, no, now I just want to check upon Scarfed God. Seriously, are you kidding me? We have Scarfed God. Oh my god, if I ever go to take that guy in one of my teams, seriously. I have to, uh, like, in the sidebars, how long is his fucking name going to be? Oh my god, where is Scarfed God? I just need to go to Scarfed God. Look at fucking Wingle, look at this derpy ass face, oh my lord. Oh my lord, L Gus, nice and Gus, nice and water gun, oh my god, summary, keen eye, this thing is so useless, oh my lord, have you guys seen his special defense, really, what's that, 5, it's a special defense stat of 5, oh my god, his special defense is so low, See, we have scarved god, guys, we have scarved god, we have Wongo, we have god, oh my lord, we have Pico! Pico! Oh my lord. Pico. <laughs> I am so happy that we have that guy. Oh my lord. I never, never, ever, ever would have thought that we would get a uh, Wingo out of that egg. Like, I was thinking of so many Pokemon, but not Wingo. Okay, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, get some boxes and I'm going to get some nice items. So, give me a moment. Look what I got for you guys. We have a wait a minute. What? Um, uh, wait a minute. What? Wait. Did I store them? No. I had to take them. What the? No. Okay. But these were all the items that we uh, could take. Oh my lord! Look at all them boxes. I don't even think that I have enough money to actually go and uh, get all those boxes unboxed. I guess. Uh, let's just grab um, all those boxes. Let's see how many we can open. Okay, let's do this shit. Xatu, you're not red. Stop this. It has been a long time. Wow, I love you too. Yes! Rio Lutil! That will give me more attack and all that shit. Yes! Okay, what the heck is happening? I noticed that the way that you taste it, you drink, and obviously it's a gourmet. I would love to join you. Oh, what? Yes! Join me, Glamiao. Okay, so it's a milk Glamiao. I have no idea what I'm going to call it. So, a uh, Twitter power active. 
Okay, so this was actually a nickname from Swagaloo, yeah, and another guy, so I'm going to use his nickname because two people wanted me to call him that. And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to say for you guys convenience, my Twitter link will always be in the description down below. It's going to be the last thing down below, oh, like always, because it's more relevant stuff that has to be above it. So hopefully you guys, if you guys want to give me a nickname suggestion, you can just go on Twitter and you can just go and give me a nickname once I ask for one. So let's just go and eat some more gummies. Now that we're done with Spinda, I guess I'm just going to look what this girl has to offer for me. Um, calcium. Wow, okay. Um, let's try and get some more items then, I guess. So, we chose for red. So, let's see what we can get. Right, red. Give us something nice. Ah, wow. Okay, we get the constellation prize. Okay, fuck you. Okay, so what do we... <laughs> Orange berry. Uh, nice, uh, seriously, nice and fucking... Uh, that sucks so much okay let's just go and um, go to Torco and after that I guess I'm just no you know what because the episodes already 20 minutes I'm going to leave Torco for the next episode just to be a little just to have it a little bit more exciting so hope you guys enjoyed this episode and I will see you guys later after I've saved here because I always need to save before I'm going to end the episode so hope you guys hope you guys will enjoy this episode and the next episode and then the next episode after that and after that and after that and i will see you guys later <laughs>